everybody. Hey, I'm here to talk to you about the Ring Floodlight Cam. So, I've had mine for a couple of years now and I uh, haven't really had any problems with it. I can say for a fact that when the temperature gets uh, below 25 degrees, the Ring uh, Floodlight Cam, the uh, lights on it actually flash and uh, they go dim as they're not as bright so what can you do I looked through the forums on ring I looked through many uh, searches there's not really any fix for these it's basically uh, something wrong with the uh, circuit board for the LED uh, lights and uh, as far as what I could find so you can do one of two things one is you can replace it by a new one if yours isn't under warranty or number two uh, you can call ring with your subscription as long as you activate your ring device and it never falls out of warranty they will replace it for you so and I'll show you what this looks like it basically flashes and blinks on and off. Um, their fix for this was to reset it on the actual device. And I have done that. It, it did not work. You can also power it down and everything. The only thing that makes it come back up is uh, warm weather. So I just don't think that these are made for uh, variable temperatures. So here it is actually working right now. I'll see if I can make it uh, flicker, but as you can see, one of the bulbs is very low compared to the other one. I mean, you can see the difference in the brightness. So if you have that uh, problem, where it's flashing or blinking intermittently like that. You can try resetting it. There's a reset button on the device. Uh, you just look at your manual. Uh, if not, the best tip I can give you is to call Ring. Hopefully your warranty did not run out. These all come with a one year subscription. So if you add all of the Ring devices at one time, and you pay your subscription like that, uh, then when your warranty runs out, you automatically just have it added in there. That's the best way. If you lose any days on your warranty, they won't replace it or anything. So I'm just kind of stuck with buying a new one. So I'm going to go with a different brand this time because I basically bought two cameras, a doorbell, and the floodlight. And it's the same subscription price for the same as what these floodlights cost. And it's just terrible uh, that it had to go this way. But um, hopefully, if you are thinking about buying Ring in the future, make sure your devices are under warranty. You have to have that subscription anyway. So uh, make sure you do not let that warranty lapse. If you found this video helpful at all, like and subscribe and uh, share with your friends who also have ring devices uh, especially if they have this floodlight if this ever happens so good luck thank you